Let's get dizzy. Hey guys, here we go at Lucas Oil Raceway. We are in the Formula Sprint, the USF 2000, and I got something to show off. This is uh, three days in a row, I got a new paint job. Now I want your help, guys. See this little thing here that's red? Your mate Patrick's done two versions. There's the red one and the blue one. You guys are gonna decide which one you prefer, the red or the blue. Well, See what happens. <laughs> I think the way this race is going to go, it's going to end up up against the wall, but we'll see what happens. Thanks to everyone who's subscribed lately. I really appreciate it. If you haven't yet, click on that subscribe button down below and hopefully I can give you some good racing, but I don't know. Good luck, everyone. Yeah, temp is 25 Celsius. P12. Now the guy, Don... <laughs> Come on, Naka. This is a 21 second lap. Follow. Well it's going to be. In the outside column. This guy in front of me crashed into me during um, practice. <laughs> I might have overreacted a little bit. I don't want to do any weaving today. Um, that front right tire is going to get hot, hot, hot. We're, uh, I'm going to go up a bit. It's on like 57%. I'll do it 54. We don't need to adjust brakes. There's no real braking here today. We're over racing, huh? New addition to Formula Sprint, but it's um, something that we did in Pro Mazda. Like there was always one or two oval tracks a year, a season, sorry. And yeah, just, I know it's totally a different type of racing and it's pretty cool to bring the, the road guys into it. Okay, now I was going to do a Bumps ready. and Bends video about this, but not only did I run out of time, Go, go. I figure up circle. Left. I'm expecting them all to crash. We're outside. Unbelievable. We're outside. Well, he's flying. That guy's just running against the wall. Alright, Glenn. The next car is Lemons. The leader's just done a 20.73. I'm happy this middle line at the moment. They're all taking the outside line. Sorry, three. I wasn't uh, crashing. Up there. No, there's no pace car today. Yeah, number three. That's the pro that you're not supposed to ride while you're supposed to race. Eighth place. That was a 21.8. Number one there as well. Yeah, let's do some pro desk because I'm pretty yeah, sure that's the vacation. In front is now zero point six. He was zero. seriously riding against the wall, wasn't he? Like was a 21.58. Stay out of it. Okay, Glenn, there's a car exit in the pits. Heads up. Clear, clear to the outside. I'm set always. That was a 21.15. If you've got lemons, you make lemonade. Lemons behind is increasing. It's now 1.28. Your 
last lap time was at 21.26. Outside. Hold your line. Hold your line. We're outside. So this is a purchase track. And um, participation's quite low. This is the only split. So the road racer tells me, cut the apex, but the oval guy says, stay out here, pick a lane. Where's Zach? B2. That was at 21.44. Yeah, Don's out. It's a good thing there's no cautions actually. Sullivan is now in the lead. The gap to Lemons behind is increasing. It's now 1.46. Turn in a bit later, maybe. This is kind of my practice race, the first one for the week. It's cool to check out what's happening. You don't get caught up in those wrecks. There's no shame in wrecking. I mean, uh, breaking to avoid a wreck. The dynamic of the car does change. Lap was at 21.25. You've got 10 minutes left, 10 minutes to go. So they're all going really high, aren't they? The lap time was at 21.30. Okay, Glenn, that's good consistency, keep it up. The gap to Lemons behind is now 1.55. Pick a lane, mate. Pick a lane. I'm crossing the lanes. I don't have a lot of oval experience. I have had a win though, Pro Mazda. I got bump drafted into first place, five wide, sorry, four wide, and one guy behind me bump drafted me on the last lap. A win's a win. <laughs> Freebie. Lemons behind is now 1.38. So I don't know if he did that on his own, but. B6. That lap time was 21.49. Here comes Lemons. I reckon that front right is roasting. The gap in front is now 3.9. And I think that was Walter's strategy. Was 21.53. So, can we all guys agree on that we will all protest these fucking wall riders? That's not racing, that's just abusing a buck in the game. Yeah. I agree with you, the answer is one of them. While these guys talk, I hope they will ban the Thunder Forever. 
Yeah, they surely will. It's the same thing as uh, with the uh, shortcut on Zero, Barcelona. People got two week bans for that. It's cheating. Well, I have no more. It's cheating, and you cannot cheat in a game. In a video game, simulator, or whatever you go. Here comes Walter. Nice work, buddy. There's strategy. This way, I saw like three cars. Lap time was three at 21.44. Yeah. Oh. Not picking a lane. I'm cutting across the track, really. Here comes Walter. I'll stay the high line. Inside. Hold your line. Clear inside. Let's see if we can finish on the lead lap. Uh, 21.52. Keep it steady. In the middle, three wide. Clear to the bottom. Clear all around. Car outside. Oh, come on, man. You're left down. Fuck off. Outside is clear. Car outside. Clear outside. That's wrong. That's just not fair, Walter. You are doing well there, mate. Chris. The guy behind's really only went the gaps now. One point zero zero. Is that is Sullivan? Top five. Okay, Glenn. Five minutes to go. Five minutes left. It's gonna be a long five minutes. Outside. Hold your line. Clear to the top. Clear outside. Car high. I'm staying inside. Clear. Clear high. Car high. Still there. Is he caught rejoining? Still there. Clear okay. high. Sixth Why place. My car was the was best 22.38. Car outside. Clear outside. I got a gap behind. I'd rather look forward than behind. Big gap behind us now. For all you over racers, please don't cringe too much. Okay. Oh, you're going in too low. <laughs> I know, I know. That lap was a 21.80. Car outside. I'm happy here. I'm in my little happy place. I mean, there's a car of five. At the end of the straight there, something's going to happen. Right, it's just risky, Matt's got to negotiate all of that in front of him. Risk versus reward, here comes Will and Rico. P6. Clear to the wall. Sullivan is 
closing in. The gap is now 15 seconds. That was a 22.59. Car high, clear outside. What's just happening? Car high, clear high. Outside, oh, they are wall riding. The they don't know how to drive. They just uh, drive against on, the wall push, without push, push. We can get this guy. Turning from inside, clear inside. Wait, I just got four. Go okay, right wheel. Debris. That's two minutes left. Two minutes. Car high, clear high. I don't think the car's too badly damaged. P5. <coughs> well, this race has taken on a whole new meaning, isn't it? Will's cruising. Do I unlap myself? That lap was at 22.80. Outside. Clear, clear to the outside. And here comes Zach. Sixth place. That is just well that there wasn't. But you look in the mirror, it's right high against the wall. He was. There he goes, just high up against 22. the wall. Just done a 22.83. My prediction is by the end of the week that wall riding will be eliminated. Once more, thank you for everyone who did not wall finish. run well and for those who wall ride this race. I hope Nim gives you the hammer a good time and you enjoy your vacation from iRacing because that is not racing, that is abusing Buck and abusing Buck is cheating and cheating is for low life scums so hope that made your day guys. Good luck in the future races. Bye! Well done Jack. <laughs> I'm not impressed. That's amazing. Well, I had no wing at the yeah, time. It's, yeah, it's kind of annoying when this was the only race I ran after 12 hours of work and then there's people like that. Does not make me happy. Does not make me happy with our race. The thing is, is I got 4X there because I hit a piece of debris. I hit one too, but I got a 0X on it. That's weird. With all the damage on the track, it ended up being an obstacle course. I lost my whole front wing from it. Yeah, my I hit a piece of debris and my front wing came off and I got a whopping 4X. Here we go. We've got talkers and texters. Zach says, surely this is iRacing's mistake. It's not my problem if iRacing makes some mistakes. Nah, not really, Zach. Sorry. <laughs> What do you reckon, guys? I think there's a lot of people might get reported for that.
Is he gone? Well, I guess, Jack, it's just a matter of proce process the protest and see what happens. Surely it'll be fixed within a day or two um, with an update. You know, it's illegal to protest, to chant with a protest too, though. Sorry? It's protestable to threaten someone with a protest. It's not threatening with a <laughs> protest if we're literally clipping you and protesting you. It's not a threat. It's a fact. We're just letting you know that, hey, that is not allowed according to the sporting code. And because you did not believe it even mid race, you even caused me to wreck with your wall riding. Yes, I yes. protest you. I did not cause you to do anything, mate. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of things going on, isn't there? No, Jack, I did not call you uh, bad words, but uh, I called you esports driver. Under if 18. that's offensive, then you have to take that up with someone else. <laughs> I heard you say it, mate. So I don't know what you're talking about now. Well, then you can protest me for saying that, if I did say that. I do apologize if I use such language. This is the only race of my day, and you guys ruined it, so hope you're happy with it. Yeah, Zach, I'm, uh, I'm going to contact your manager, actually, and let's see what he thinks about that. Like, you're not going to be the next actor or something unless you start acting like one. I'm pretty sure he's not trying to be the next Mexican captain. Got to plug the channel. See his wheels physically broken, eh? Alright, he's in the wall. We stayed relatively clean. Didn't we? This got spicy. <laughs> I did not expect this. It's something with four turns. I'm sorry, in Australia, that would be two. <laughs> but with four corners, that's ended up more interesting than I expected. 1681 strength of field single split today this is a purchase track so a lot of people um won't do this this week i might still do a bumps and bends learn the better line wow zach's a 5000 i rating and he finished in front of me and lost 20. i got 21 i rating 72 points and I didn't even get in the 20s. So these times are false as well. Chris was... He crashed in front of me when he um, overtook. Let's have a look at his lines.
That's legit too. And he finished in 11th. Because people who did crash out <sighs> took him out. There you go, Nim. Busy day for you, mate. Busy, busy day. I'm sure this is not the only race that it's happened. And um, yes, very, very interesting. I can't believe how many laps we did. He, uh, Chris did 38. Wow. And overall, 43 was from the leader. I got 42 in. <laughs> but yeah, it scales down real quick, doesn't it? Well, thanks for watching, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. That's a spicy little race. I did not expect that. <laughs> Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Down if you didn't, make sure you subscribe. Check me out on Twitch. Let me know what exhaust thing you want, the red or the blue. I'm swinging either way. Either way. Have a great day, guys. See you next time. Bye.